So hi guys welcome to my youtube channel Aquafina. So in this video I am going to discuss about how to cure yellow lab cichlids. The yellow lab cichlids is one of the most peaceful and docile of the embuna species. They are very versatile and adaptable to all types of cichlid setups. They are aggressive to fish that have a similar color, shape and build as them. Native to the water of Lake Malawi, the south southernmost e lake in the East Africa Rift system and the ninth largest lake in the world. Eurolap cichlid thrives in larger bodies of water. So the average size of the Eurolap cichlids in the wild is 3.2 inches with the ability to grow up to 4 inches in well maintained aquariums and tanks. Now let's talk about differentiating between the male and the female Eurolap cichlids can be heard. Both sexes look similar though males have a faint grey vertical stripes on the sides where females do do not. Unlike males, female ventrals and anal fins are pale yellow and do not have an egg spot. Unlike other freshwater fish, the Eurolap cichlids has a long lifespan ranging between 6 to 10 years, depending on the quality of the care. So if you are planning to get one, keep in mind that you must stay committed for years. The perfect tank for the Eurolap cichlids must resemble their native home. The bigger the better, an ideal tank size should be at least 40 to 50 gallon but do not afraid to go higher. So Eurolap cichlids are semi-aggressive. So they need their space. The illusion of small space can be created by adding the line of sight block to prevent them from seeing the end of the tank. The Eurolap cichlids natural habitat is tropical. So temperature so, so temperature maintained should be maintained between 22 and 28 degrees Celsius. Water hardness must be between 10 to 20. Aquarium lighting is important but often overlooked and sometimes confusing. The type of aquarium lights needed for any size of the fish tank depends on your habitat within the tank. In Lake Malawi, the light is diffused by plant and rocks formation. To mimic this, you need to use a medium to low lighting effect in, the, in your tank. The Eurolap cichlids also need frequent water change to keep it healthy. The recommended water change size is 10% to 20% bi-weekly to ensure the tank stay clean. Now let's talk about the food and diet. Naturally, the yellow lab cichlid is carnivorous, though in aquarium it is best to feed them an omnivorous diet. They are versatile in what they can eat, meaning they can easily eat fresh and live food as well as high quality flake foods. Their recommended diet is an equally balanced 50-50 portion of plants and animals. If they eat too much protein in one feeding, they are likely to contact Malawi bloat, a common disease amongst yellow labs. So to be so to be sure to ensure your proteins and plant quick equally. So some recommended food are high quality flake food, dried shrimp and bloodworms. For meaty protein foods such as shrimp or bloodworm, it is best to have them dried or already dead to eliminate to eliminate the potential of any fish getting hurt. Shrimp and bloodworm can be potentially injured Eurolap ciglet. So these are all information regarding how to cure Eurolap ciglets. I hope this video will help you. More videos are coming soon. So please stay tuned to my channel.